Hello, guys. Back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question. Okay. So this question belongs to Gate CSC 2014 Set 3. Okay. So the given question is consider the transactions T1, T2, T3. Okay. Ah, uh, and the schedulers S1 and S2 given below. Okay. So they are these three transactions have converted into these two schedulers. Okay. So I think this is also based on conflict serializability, right? Yes. So let us start. Okay. So let me start from the top, guys. So schedule one S1. So it is having a T1, T2, and T3. Okay. So we are having a read of X. It's visible, right? Yes. Okay. So read of X. Read of sorry. Read of Y. Okay. So read of X. Okay. So read of Y. Okay. So read of Z. Okay. So write of Y. Okay. So write of Z. Okay. Then we are having read of Z. Okay. Then we are having write of X. Then we are having write of Z. So let us cross check again. So it's really lengthy. So that's the reason why I'm cross checking it. Read of X. Read of Y. Read of X. Read of Y. Read of Z. Uh, read of Y. Read of Z. Read of Z. Read of X. Read of Z. Okay. Yes. So basically, the subscripts indicates the uh, in which number we need to write, guys. Okay. Yes. Okay. So now this question is clear, right? So let us draw this precedence graph. So T1, T2. T three. Okay, so here we are having read of x. So is it going to clash anyone, guys? No. Here we are having only read of x. So read will clash with the right, right? Yes. Okay. So he similarly here we are having read of y. Okay. So this read of y will clash with okay. Okay. So here also there is no issue. Wow. Here we are having read of x. Yeah. Here we are having an issue. So t three to t one. So t three to t one. There is one issue. Okay. Moving on, so this is done. So here we are having read of y. So here we are having write of y. T two to T three. So T T two T three. Okay. So this is done. So read of z. So this is also read of z. So no issue. Done. Write of y. No issue. Done. Write of z. Write of z with read of z. So T two to T one. So T two to T one. Nice. So this is also done. So everyone is done. Okay. Yes. So now what is the serializability order, guys? So it is a nothing but first we will perform T two. Followed by T3, followed by T1. So I have done it based on the topological order, right? So here income outcoming edge, sorry, incoming edges are zero, incoming edges one, incoming edges two. So based on that, we have written, right? Yes. Okay. So now let us try for the other one also. Okay. So just give me a second. So I'll be taking a small piece of paper. Okay. So let us start. So when it comes to this second part of the question, so here also we are having the same T1, T2, and T3. Okay, so when it comes to here, it is the first performing read of x, read of y, read of y, uh, read of x, uh, read of z, read of z, uh, write of y, uh, write of x, write of z, write of z. Okay, so the first thing which which I have observed is so if we try to write t one, t two. And T3. So here there is a direct clash, right? Yes. So T2 to T1 there is a clash exists. So let us start. So here it is read of x. So is there any write of x in other two columns? No. So here we are having read of y. So is there any write of y in other two columns? So no. So here read of y. So is there any read of y in other columns? No. Here we are having read of x. Is there any write of x in other columns? So I think it is write of x only here, right? Yes. So it is write of x. So basically here we are having a T three to T one, okay. So this is also done. Similarly, here we are having read of Z. So here we are having write of Z. So T one to T two. So T one to T two. Okay. So I have found a loop. So that's a loop, right? So indirectly, S one is not conflict serializable. So basically, option A is the correct answer. Got it? Yes. So this is a quite easy question, right? Yes. So I think this is around tenth or eleventh question, right? We are solving with respect to conflict serializability. I think everyone now understood how much important these questions are, right? Yes. Okay. So I hope everyone got a clear idea with respect to this question. Okay. And these all are two more questions, guys. Okay. Yes. Okay. So I hope everyone got a clear idea with respect to this question. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. Okay. Yes. So let us meet in the next lecture. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.